Hi there, this is David Detman with the next bonus training. Alright, what we've got here is, this is the last one we did. This is on how to make cool photos. Now the reason I'm doing this one is simply the two are going to work together well. Uh, reason is, is it came up today which uh, some people need to resize their photos when doing these various different things. So I thought to myself, well, why not chuck in a free program? Why not? Okay, this program here is IR Fan View. Now look, you can use this with various different media files. It's not just a photo editor, uh, but I use it solely for a photo editor. I've actually had this program for about eight years, and whenever I've been stuck, I just come in here. It's a very light program, and it's a free program. Okay, this is just something I just did up. Now this photo here was done in the last session with the uh, other site. And what I've done is I've added text, and I've added a border, and I've even cropped it. Alright. Anyway, we'll open up with a different photo. Here we go, we'll try this one. Okay, how do we resize? That's probably the first one you want to know. Well, it's very simple. You can put in the dimensions here, or you can pick out this list, or you can just press half or double. How easy is that? Okay, I'm going to double it. All right, now what we will do next. This will go to effects. Bring the effects button up. Now, this way you can see what you're doing. Uh, there's various different effects here. I mean, that's a pretty cool effect. So on for this example, I'm going to pick just going to swirl it a little bit. Okay, let's see what happens here. All right. How cool is that? Now the other thing I want to do, so I was doing this earlier, is add some raindrops. <laughs> Why not? Alright, one more thing. Okay, where are we here? I'll go into the, the effects browser. That that's the best way simply because you know if you don't like what you see you can just um, apply original image or undo uh, we've layered what one two effects so far into this okay this is one which I thought standard out okay this is rock so how cool is that now to finish it off uh, what I'm going to do is add a border I've lost it again. Bear with me. I've just got to find it. Sometimes you get too many options and you don't know what you're doing. <laughs> I know it's there, I just had it uh, previously. Okay, add border or frame. <laughs> now obviously this one doesn't suit. I did that on the last one. Okay. Dunno. Uh, yeah, maybe. Plain white border. How's that? I didn't even have to choose the colours. <laughs> but yes, you can choose the colours here. So you could definitely muck around with that. Alright. So that's one more we've done. Alright, let's pick another one. 
<laughs> the, these were all done with the other program we were talking about in the last training. Let's do the alien. <laughs> all right. Okay, what we're going to do here. is add some text okay now you can pick the background uh, let's uh, I wonder if I can find how are my color skills that's a bit of a cross isn't it yeah, that's... oh it's close all right now I help average people online <clears throat> it's a funny one to do for this, but <clears throat> now what you can also do is you can choose the front, go bald, increase various different fronts. Okay, let's see how this goes. So you can add your text, you could add your website here, you could probably blend it into the background, make it clear. Um, that's another cool thing you can do. Now, for instance, if you want to crop, just to quickly show you, get it, crop this section. There we go. Now, for instance, you want to make it bigger, double, cause that. Hey, there's a lot of other little different features in here. Yeah, you can take out eyes, you can do all sorts of things. Uh, once again, this is 100% free. I will put this training in my bonus training section, which is here. Learn with Dave. All right, now, I've also got a Skype group just quickly, which is only set up today. Uh, so you can ask me to join this Skype group and I'll post when I put the new ones up. I'm going to try and do about five a day. I mean, sorry, five a week. Um, on various things, not just on photos. The only reason I've done two photo ones is I thought they worked well together. So please leave your feedback on my blog. If you're on another site, uh, I will send put a link under the video to the blog and leave comments on the blog. And please, if you like my stuff... Also, press the like button on Facebook. That would be really cool. Alright, this is David Detman, and I hope you enjoyed it. Until next time.